80 miles per hour, high speed internet from space. Take a look at these results. Right, it's ready to test. I've got it mounted on the roof. You can see the magnets underneath. I've got some white ropes here just for safety in case the magnets don't hold. Um, hopefully we won't need those ropes to do anything, but in case the wind catches underneath here and it's just too much and it flies off, I want the ropes there just to make sure I don't lose the whole thing on the highway. All right, here we go. Okay, here we go, onto the highway. All right, so this is 80 miles per hour, 130 kilometers per hour. I'll have to look at the footage later to make sure that the, uh, the dish is actually staying staying on the roof. I haven't heard it clunking around yet though. This is incredible. So I'm cruising down the highway, 80 miles per hour, 130 kilometers per hour. High speed internet from space, from a constellation of satellites that are orbiting the Earth at far faster speeds. And I'm getting almost no disruptions Take a look at these results. And this would work anywhere on the planet. Yeah, there is a, a small blip in the network stats, the uptime, just going under that overpass. I think even without the station in motion, just the fact that roaming is now enabled, that I can set this up in a stationary location anywhere in Canada and get high-speed internet is pretty amazing. I'm definitely going to be taking it off the roof and uh, bringing it camping. So there you have it, over 200 megabits per second driving down the highway, 130 kilometers, 80 miles per hour.